What's up guys? For today's video, I will be making a comparison video on the Champion S700 and the Champion something. I actually uh, could not find out the name for this. I googled it for a solid like 20 minutes and cannot figure out what this is. But I did pick this up at Myers just to make this comparison video to see what the hype is because everyone knows that the S700 is super hyped up. Not as hyped up as the reverse weave but uh, that an S700 is crazy. Everyone loves these. They love picking these up in a bunch of colors. So I really wanted to just compare the hype. So I picked this up at uh, my local Meyer. Now, if, you, if you're not uh, from this area, you don't know what Meyer is. Meyer is basically kind of like Walmart, kind of not. But I was able to pick this one up for $11. And I picked this one up online for 20 some dollars shipped. So it's basically about half the price. Uh, there are a few things uh, that I wanted to point out. Now, to be honest, feeling them, this uh, Meyer version, so I'll just call this the Walmart version so everyone can be on the same page. So this Walmart version of the of the Champion, um, of the Champion hoodie is actually feels way nicer in my opinion. So I was actually kind of shocked about that. I would assume this one would be better. But this is the uh, Champion one where they have the Champion C here. I even think you can get this at Kohl's, but I'm not entirely sure. But the Champion on the sleeve, where the S700 has nothing on the front, which I really like, and they only have it on the sleeve, which I also really like. So off top, like I said, this one feels way nicer and way higher quality. Like, like you could easily tell the difference that this is way higher quality than this one. And the other thing that I like more about this is there's actually like the sewing right here that keeps the drawstring in just this like little tunnel. Like you can't, it won't move out. Where on the S700, it, the string can end up all the way back here, which is was super annoying. Like here's the front of it. There's no uh, sewing on this. So this can just like uh, fall all the way back here and just mess up the entire hood and mess up the entire purpose of the drawstring. I hate that. I super hate that. I can't even stress how much I hate that actually because I've had some other super cheap hoodies that did not, that had that problem and the drawstring just falls behind you and just messes up the hoodie, honestly. Now, I picked this one up in a large and it was kind of small, so I'm actually happy that I bought this one first. So then I picked this one up uh, in an extra large and it is really nice. So I am gonna compare the fits, but I almost feel like that's kind of cheating because they're different, uh, different sizes. But this one fits, and the large fits all right, but this one fits perfect. Like, the most perfect fit that you could have in a hoodie is this. So I think the fit is why people pick this up so much and like why this is so hyped the fit is just insane i cannot stress that enough i'll give you a comparison now there were some things i didn't like about it like the drawstring thing and all that but th definitely would recommend the hoodie i would pick it up it fits nicer than the uh, walmart version but that could just be the size i don't know but the other thing too that i really like about this one over the walmart version is uh, the ribbing on the bottom. I'm one of those people that just hate the ribbing when it like sticks to your stomach or like your waist. I don't like that at all. So this actually just like falls. I was actually go got the XL so I, so I could cut it off, but I don't even need to because it doesn't like scrunch up. Where on this one, it has like the scrunching, the scrunch ribbing on it. So I would cut this one off, but it already is so short being a large that I'm not gonna cut it off. But that's why I like this. This one just falls perfectly on your body. Just has that perfect fit to it. I did like that one so much that I did pick it up in gold right here. Uh, I had to buy this on Amazon because everywhere else the gold one was sold out. So I don't know if gold is like a hyped up color or something, but I love it. And here it is right here. Let me make sure these are uh, like built the same way before I talk all this about them. So yeah, definitely doesn't have the sewing on it to keep the drawstring in lock. So that does kind of suck. And it has a really nice champion logo there. So yeah, it looks great. Love, I love the gold colorway. My camera never really picks things up. It kind of looks more like an orange-ish maybe, but it's definitely gold. It looks really nice in person, so I'm gonna be wearing this one a lot. And I did also just realize the inside of them is the same color as the hoodie, where on the Walmart version, they actually like gray out the inside. So that's kind of interesting. Oh, another thing too is there's like these metal I don't know if these are called aglets. I know on like shoelaces they are, but I don't know if they call it on the strings. But they have like the metal end tips where on the S700 you're just like plastic. 
So there are some things I wish I could copy from this and paste it onto this. But just because the fit is so good on the S700, I will rank the S700 better than the Walmart version. Like the, the fit is just what uh, what would draw me into it the most. So that's why I would rank the S700 better. Now, do I think the S700s are worth it, the money? Uh, I definitely do. Like they're only 20, $25 shipped, so it doesn't even break the bank at all. A very affordable hoodie, super nice fit. I would recommend sizing up if you want to get like that perfect fit. I'll show you what they look like right now. So it depends really if you want to go to your true to size. Like I feel like my true to size is a large, so I up to size to get that nice perfect fit on me. So that's really entirely up to you on what sizing you're going to go with. But you did just see the sizing I had and I do prefer the S700 over the Walmart version. Even though the Walmart version had those few little specs that make it that make it like look nicer, I still think the S700 is the overall better hoodie. So I will leave some links down below for you to pick up an S700 if you're interested. Like I did cop the gold one off Amazon because I could not find the gold one anywhere else. But I'll check uh, eBay, Amazon, Champions website and some other places that we might be able to find some affordable S700s. So definitely pick those up if you can. So I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did please like, comment and subscribe. Share it around with your friends. Show them about the S700 and make sure you check out my other videos too. And thanks for watching.